Yo, what is good everybody? It's your boy, The Strongest Wizard, and today I received an amazing package from the young creative god himself, and that's Joku. Joku does like these incredible custom Dawn cards, custom leader cards, you probably already know who he is. He's also a content creator, I don't know what else this guy doesn't do, he does it all, right? So I'm just really excited to get into this, I got this extremely amazing package today, and honestly, as you can tell, I'm a fan. Like, this guy does in some incredible work, so I'm really excited to get into this. So, yeah, let's dive in. Alright, it's time to open this baddie up. I'm extremely excited. I mean, dude, even the, the artwork on the packaging, I mean, this guy got custom bags done. I mean, come on. That's, if this man doesn't mean business, I don't know what does. But, yeah, I pretty much, I pretty much heard about Joku, um... Initially, um, initially saw him uh, actually at Treasure Cup. I saw him at Treasure Cup, and I was like super excited because uh, I it was like round seven or six or something, and this guy, the only uniquely dressed one there at the event, super steezed out um, at this event. He was like, I played him against his red green Luffy. I never even played against the Red Green Luffy before. He beat me. Congrats to him. Destroyed me. Uh, but uh, it was a good time. Uh, and then a friend of mine named Thomas, and I saw that he had a custom, uh, a custom leader card. And I was like, dude, that looks freaking amazing. What 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 is this? And he's like, dude, this is this guy I found on Facebook. His name's Joku. He's really talented, really good. And so I hit up Joku, and I was like, yo, we gotta. We gotta work something out, bro, because I need you to send me something. This is, this stuff looks so sick. And well, we're here now. So uh, he sent me a few cards here. And so first card, let's see, went out the bag. Uh, super cool, look how look how cool this is, this reflective back end. And they're all case too. So you can get the cards alone or you can get them with the case. And um, the card alone is just the artwork of the card. With the case, you actually get it with, um, with the, uh, like with the leader ability, with the name, and which the first card is. Oh man, this is the one I was probably the most excited for. It's Ace. Look how clean this looks, yo. Are you kidding me? Yeah. So I'm actually really excited um, to play Ace next set. So I'm extremely happy I got this card. Um, look at the texture, gosh. And obviously, you know, it's important to mention, you can't use these cards at like treasure cups or regionals or things like big events like that. But just ask your TO if they're okay with it. Most locals will be okay with it. I don't see any reason at all why they wouldn't be. Um, but man, it's so good. Look at that, look at the foiling, look at the art, the texture, you see that? That's nuts. Oh man, yeah, and I'm super excited to play with Ace. Um, my two favorite leaders next set for OPO3 is definitely gonna be Ace and Nami. I know my girl Nami got hit, we hate to see it, but um, I think it's actually still viable. I haven't done any testing on it yet, but you know, we'll see. Uh, next card here, let's see what we have. Second one is, ooh, Nami. Oh, and he threw in a sticker here. Yo, let's go. Let me take out the sticker so we can see the card fully. Um, here, I can show you guys real quick just how it looks now. Look how good that Nami looks, yo. I love it because usually, you know, it's just so simple and like sleek. The colors are really good. I like the purple and the blue. Um, obviously with her, with her, uh, her baton, you know. Looks so good. Let me open this up. If we actually take the card out and we look at it on its own, beautiful, right? Like, look how clean that is. And it's weird because it, the texture of the card is actually really durable. It looks really, really good. So, and then as you can see here, the, the case is actually printed on, which is really nice. So whenever you wanna just have the you know the card as artwork or you actually want to use it you can do either one like it doesn't matter and so there she is she's beautiful very nice 
Oh man, that ace is so good. It's so good too because it's like liquid fire. You know what I mean? Sorry, I had to take a look at it again. Too good. And then the last card here, it's my boy Law. Um, and this is actually the one that my friend Thomas has. Uh, and I'm like, dude, I, the, the writing on the top, it just looks so clean. So good. And you know, Law is is pretty much tier one OPO2 as well. So I'm definitely gonna be running this. These two I'm gonna have on the back burner, ready to go, locked in, ready for next set. But man, yeah, Joku killed it. And you can see here in the link, I'm gonna have literally his URL to buy these cards and all that good stuff um, here. So uh, yeah, so awesome, so awesome. And um, yeah, yeah, guys, that's gonna be it for today. Uh, shout out to him for hooking me up with these cards. Uh, phenomenal dude, extremely nice. Uh, let's see if there's anything else in here. Oh, let's go. I've heard about these, these coins. Look how sick this is. The man's got his own currency going on. Look how sick that is. So cool, dude. So cool. I love the branding. I love the creativeness on it. Super awesome. So thank you so much, Roku, for sending me these. I really appreciate you, brother. And thank you everyone else for watching this. Uh, hopefully you guys are inspired by these cards or want to play or hey, maybe you're excited for OPO3 like I am. So anyways, guys, thank you much for so much for watching this video and stay tuned because I have a ton of new OPO2 and OPO3 content coming out soon. See ya.